Brad Bonnell, the head coach for the Tigers, and we are underway tonight in Blacksburg. Great to have you with us. Abisabini in the lane. They'll work it around the perimeter. Aline, and finally, first make of the night. You knew it was just a matter of time, Chris. <laughs> Lived and died from that three-point arc. Okies want to push the tempo. Quickly getting to the other end, and in one as well. Radford went in strong and drew the foul at Iowa his first year. And then a, a guy by the name of Luca Garza showed up. That'll limit your playing time if you're a big. And finally, they're going to break through. 11th year for the Tigers. Nice. Swooping in. Ooh. Great defensive stop by the Hokies. He can be instant offense. He certainly was against Penn State. He's going to throw it away, however. Right in the hands of Bear. He goes up for it and defend it. But the lay-in is good. Great yeah, defense on the other end by Mutz. Big part of their offensive arsenal. Katora let fly. Yes, and he can do that. If you give him that much space, he can drill it. Here it is. Sims with a spin. Yes, well, you called that matchup, and that's a beautiful shot. Number 18, Syracuse at Chapel Hill to battle North Carolina. No Tigers with the ball. Oh, that's a beautiful shot using that hand. Picky up 94 feet, man to man. Really tough in the half court. Beatty on the drive and got it up and in. Coming into this game tonight. It's an area where, of course, Virginia Tech lives and dies. Shot clock a factor now, right down the lane, oh. and a stuff by Radford. And a foul on the play, a sensational drive. One thing you know in this game, everything is challenged. Don't come in here with that soft stuff in this game against either team, what a challenge. But more than that, how about the take by Tyrese Radford? Shot clock down to three. He's going to step in and lay it in. Trapped with an outstanding play. A few games they were on fire with it. They shot over 42%, but last couple of games, not so beautiful. Spin and Aluma showing you a little bit of his game. Downstairs, Pepsil off the fake, and Sims got a piece of it. He deflected that away on a rejection. Wide open is trap, and he sticks the triple. Hokies with the tight D. And in by Justin Mutz, the junior. Go to Sims. Yes, on pencil. Pass barely got there. Dawes will line it up. And he hits it from three-point land. Who showed up and then, yeah, okay, my minutes are going to go down. Where, what school was that where I had 17 boards? That's, Dawes will sink a long-distance shot. He was really good on the glass. He had 12 rebounds. Thrown away on a dipsy do pass right to Radford. Outside long distance and knocked in by Aline. Dawes trying to use the screen. Beyond that three-point line, he's going to step back and fire and absolutely <laughs> drained it. Wow. Money shot. Radford Dawes turns up the dribble. Long one on the way, won't drop by Aline. Rebound comes free and a one as well. He certainly can be that kind of player, but he's got to be on the floor to do it. Dawes with a little fall away. Yes, gets that one to go. The ugly loss against Penn State. On the drive. Boy, tough one. Flipped up and in by Couture. And can do it with a big basket. A lean on the drive and kick Couture. Yes! From downtown. All over the state of Virginia, actually. Hokies looking to add on, and they do. Sweet shot by Aline. In for the long one, and boy, did they need that. Naheem Aline with the miss. That opens up the door for Dawes to come back to the other end and bury a three. Oh, you had him. Aluma kicks it back out. Nice. A great look inside for the easy two. 
Conference play really heating up here over the last few days. This is the opener of the conference for both of these schools. Bear, nice catch and shoot for three. Sims on the baseline. Banging with the Luma. Oh, what a nifty nice. feed, and yeah. they convert as well, but a terrific pass. Look at all the foul shots for the Hokies. It made 20 out of 25. Dawes again, right on cue with another three. Abisa Beatty jumping in. He sticks it. Every once in a while, you know, he can make a shot. And a lot more ACC in play tonight. Nobody home, and guess who slams it down? Last year when they met on this court, but Virginia Tech beat Clemson by 12. Sweet jumper there by Clyde Trapp, and they need more of that. They've had so far this season. Honor got the pass free to the big man and banked in by Sims. Bradford. Shot clock to six. He drives it. Got Boy, he's made big shots all night, hasn't he? Tigers with the ball. Here's Honor. Got wow. it! Way downtown and a money three. And they get it across midcourt. Leading by two. Radford on the drive. Another big basket by Tyrese Radford. Shot, and then Mike Young deciding not to call a timeout here. Decides to let his guys figure it out, and the guy who's figured it out all night long. Couture makes the pair. The second half, 17 for 20 at the foul line for the Hokies. They knock off Clemson tonight, 66 to 60. Chris, a hard-earned victory.